Just wait a little bit until I get some people on. And show what I got. Two packages here that I'm gonna show. I gotta reorganize a lot of this. It's pretty well organized, but. Swifters, you know. We're gonna be putting some stuff up on the shelf. If I could show this real quick. Oh. Up here, I'm gonna put Kenner vehicles. I'm gonna get another shelf and put a bunch of Clone Wars figures. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm going, hold on. I'm gonna put a shelf here that's gonna be all Clone Wars figures. Here will be where my Detoff goes, where I'll put all my Kenner figures. I'm watching. It's like my favorite season of Clone Wars. Season three, disc one. Show it. All right. Let's go. So yeah, I got two packages. So I'm gonna do those live. All these will go on YouTube. And uh, I realized, let me get this off. There's, um, I didn't know the comments didn't post when you made, put videos up on YouTube after like saving it. So that's kind of a bummer, but <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and open these up, flip the camera around. Did not mean to click that. I was hoping I'd get a little bit more on, but we'll just leave it like that. So I'm gonna open up this one first. So this package came from, let me go turn that down, hold on. Never mind, I'm not going to, I'm gonna leave it. Okay, so this package came from a guy off of uh, Macari. So I got a couple of Clone Wars sets from Macari and then mostly just from people here on Instagram. So if you guys can't hear me, it's because I'm blasting the Clone Wars. And um, so these are all Clone Wars figures that I'm opening up in this package. There should be a decent amount. I, actually, he might be on. Oh, that's how he did it. Okay. He, uh, he might be on Instagram. I forgot. But if anything, I'll shout him out later. But there's six figures in here. So we're gonna go uh, take a look at what we got. It feels so much lighter than when you actually hold it. So here we go. I'm so pumped getting all these Clone Wars figures. Like it's, I always, I wanted them back so bad and I never like went after them. I always went after Kenner. And um, now I have like almost, like not every figure, but I got a decent amount of uh, Clone Wars figures. So here's the next bag of Clone Wars figures. I got one more. I'm trying not to buy anymore. So that is, hello, I got uh, one, two, three, four. I thought it was, no, I got, I got six figures coming in the next set. This is just four figures. So in here, we have four figures. If you're just joining i'm unboxing my first box i need to start posting that i'm going on live so people would know so i don't just do it but kind of do it whenever i want but when i get time what's up chase so we got the older weathered captain rex you said this there what's up man so the original i don't know what year this might be 2008 yep well, most of them were, but this is the weathered, like I said, Captain Rex. The original sculpt. So, yeah. So, yeah, I'm going to get, if I'll, I'll walk you through what I, I'm going, what I'm about to do with my Kenner vehicles. And then soon I'm getting my, I'm going to go get an Ikea Detoff and I'm going to put up all my uh, Kenner figures, which I'm opening Kenner figures right now. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to. I'm gonna get one more shelf. I'm gonna get that shelf, one more shelf, and then the, the shelf that the small shelf that I'm gonna put below right back. You can actually see it right here. I have that one for my Kenner vehicles that I'm about to put up. And then below it, I'm gonna put all my Clone Wars figures. Pro probably. I don't know yet. I always like do a bunch of things. That's the first figure though. Boom. 
Is that you there? By the way, I'm shouting out uh, Vintage Toy Division because the next package that I do, it is from him. So Vic got me, or I claim the next figures that are coming out of the next box. But let's go back. Then there's a blaster. Big, big blaster. Heavy blaster for whatever. I think matchstick. Oh, I, I shouted it out. I'm going to do the next one yet. But yeah, he's coming. And then boom. 2000. Yeah, I guess it's the same, but. So this is the second sculpt of Captain Rex. So this one's like my favorite. It like looks like a little bit. It look, I, I like the helmet sculpt better than the other one. So I'll show the other one I just showed you first. So that's the weathered one. This is the other sculpt. Which I like now I'm like. I'm getting into all the variants of the Clone Wars figures, and it's been fun because I have like mostly all the main characters, and they all have their blaster, at least in the picture. So yeah, they got their blasters back there. I'm watching the Clone Wars in the background. If you haven't watched the Clone Wars and you're not into like cartoons, you might not be into that. I like original Star Wars too, but I do. I did grow up. Like kind of like going into high school watching the Clone Wars, so I I think the Clone Wars is great. Like it'd be cool if like the Clone Wars like was also live action, because like real life characters it'd be crazy. So next, which all the blasters are down. Matchstick. Once I do a collection video, I'll show you like every figure that I have of Clone Wars, which is all put away. Season 7, yeah. My favorite season is the one I'm playing actually right now. It is season 3, which I have like all of them on uh, Blu-ray. So I just watch them. I have Disney Plus too, but I play them on Blu-ray. And then this is like my main go-to. I always put... What's up? I always put... This epi or these uh, episodes, the first disc from the uh, box... Admiral Ularin. I hope I didn't butcher that. I need to work on the lighting, so I got camera things on the way. I got I got a bunch of ideas. I might get like a light box. I might get more better do better lighting. And like I said before, do better videos and stuff. This is just cuz I like going on and talking to you guys more than just kind of recording. Even though I kind of want to I've been watching if Jedi Toy Masters is on here, shout out to him. I've been watching his videos and how he kind of does both and it's cool how you uh how you do both of them so which i had a sticker from jedi toy masters which i don't know where it went but i would shout out him too if i had it these are the weapons i have to get into the next set though so those are the clone wars figures Boom. so this is the main never saw him in my stores growing up when uh when i was younger in um going from middle school into high school like me and my dad used to go out i think i like said that before plenty of times but we used to go out and we would find like every figure we would drive like um, two like two hours up two hours down sometimes and just ride listen to music and then go get figures and oh my god and then go back home i think it, they're all in here okay vic if you don't this is that's how this man packs figures like crazy awesome let's slide this bad boy out first where can I set this put it on my black series helmet see I want to show my black series helmets I want to show like all the stuff I have that's not just Kenner that's why my page I've been doing different stuff just because I like Star Wars all over and back when you could find figures exactly i used to find so many like the vintage collection there used to be i used to see like maybe 12 different figures on the shelf i actually with side note i went to target today because i had to pick up my girlfriend's present that i bought her and um so i went and picked that up and then i looked at the section they had the lando the bestman lando the 40th anniversary card back ones um for empire it was pretty cool I was going to buy it, but I'd rather order it online later on and get cases on it. So, 
I wasn't really into it. But they had the they had the vintage collection figures. They had Han Solo and Luke. But I had them. I had those figures back from when the first vintage collection came out. Which, if you guys want to see something cool, I'm, I need to show this too. But hold on. If you want to see something cool, this. Oh, where can I put these? Shoot. I can't ever set anything down. I have everything everywhere. I'll show you this real quick. So. Oh, I didn't even take. Okay, I'll show you. I'm going to stop on his package because I got to show you. That's how many Clone Wars figures I had. Like every one. And now I have almost every one again. Almost every one. I'm still searching. But I'm not trying to spend $100 on a Hasbro figure. Just saying. But yeah, so that... That's what I want to show you. Like, there's some... Like, you want to... I'm not trying to brag. Like... I used to crack these things open. I used to do YouTube videos back in the day. Uh, my cha uh, bleh. my channel was Jedi Empire 66, and then I stopped. I deleted it, got rid of it. Never thought I'd do it again, and then now I'm doing it again. What? What are you gonna do with all this card? Yeah, these are. I'll keep all this. Check that out. Yeah, I'll keep. I can't. I can't sell a lot of stuff. There's so much stuff that I don't have on my page that I don't. That's on right now. Boop. That I don't show. Like I have signed. Or should I just show you everything right now? If you guys are willing to watch a cool video, I'm just gonna show you guys everything. So yeah, there's a bunch. But if you guys want to see the next, what like, why I used to be excited about actually finding action figures, I'm gonna make a mess. Yep. Made a mess, but I don't care. Woo. I have a bunch of ships inside this container out here of all vintage collection, uh, Java, Tauntauns, Land Speeder, the whatever the other vehicle is, a bunch of other ships when these all came out. So if I can, I don't think no, this one doesn't have it in there. But that's pretty cool. Oh. This one is heavy as you know what, but why I'm gonna get out what's in here so I can show you. Check that out. Hasbro used to be pretty good, and they want to take all these figures away. It sucks. Hasbro did pretty freaking good, and now they want to take it all away. If what's up, man? Action figure insider. Okay, now we get we're gonna do this, and then I'm gonna go back to what I was doing. I thought I heard my daughter. My girlfriend's out there, but I thought the speaker was in here. I can't get it out. Hold on. There's too many. There's too many of them. There's too many of them. What are we going to do? That shit made me sad. Seeing that little boy cry in Revenge of the Sith. Well, not cry, but get sad. Whoa, I got a lot more people on than I... Well, there's not that many people on, but more people joined today. So if you uh, bear with me, I just got sidetracked. And I went into some other stuff. Because I have this mess going on right now. But I was unboxing something which I'll show you more. But since we were talking about Hasbro and uh, three and three quarter inch figures, Kenner two, we got Clone Wars vintage collection. I still have more. They're all, my parents' house has everything. My house doesn't have everything. So like I have, I mean, I got, a, I got most of my collection, but there's still stuff there. So like, check this out. Oh, 
Everybody's like, dude, why'd you open that? Because I used to play with them, literally. I used to make scenes and YouTube videos and review them. This one was my favorite, dude. Look at that, dude. That's badass. Come on, Kenner. I mean, yeah, Kenner. I see Kenner on here. Come on, Hasbro. Shiny. Speaking of Clone Wars, shiny. This one was badass. I almost kept them all, but I was like, dude, I gotta open these. Like, this was when I was like young. I'm not trying to flex in the camera or something like that. I was just trying to tilt it. I'm trying to find some cool ones. Got, I had that. Mail away, uh, Boba Fett. All my uh, figures are in there. I've shown those before. If you guys have uh, like followed me for a while, I have I have all my Kenner or I keep saying Kenner. I, I have all my uh, vintage collection figures in this container up here, which I'll soon display. Now that I moved. And I don't have to, like, worry about my stuff. Alright, I'm gonna, like, slow down, because I'm trying to find one. I can't find it. Like, there's just, there was some cool... The card backs, I'm not kidding you. I don't know if it's just me. And I'm gonna say whatever I say anyway, but... These card backs are, like, not that bent. And they're a lot thicker. So I don't know if you've noticed or if that's also a thing, you know, people talk about on here. But they are, these card backs are like, the, I don't know, it's way better than what they use now. Because I go into the store and the thing looks like it like bent backwards. It's like Toy Story. We all like bent out of there. There's a bunch. Oh, they're so cool. Here we go. This is one. So yeah, I'm going to stop. So I can keep going with the counter. Let me show you what I got. But that's, yeah. So anybody who doesn't want to see those figures go, uh, make sure you do anything you can to try to keep them going. Yeah, I know. The retro co collection, all the card bags suck. And, like, I'm not a fan of, like... Of, I mean, some people are, I'm not, but I'm not a fan of, like, redoing a bunch of figures a bunch of times just because you want to change the head sculpt. Like, I get it. Like, I know there's, like, photographers that, like, they want, like, an accurate or they customize it, but, you know, just make new figures. Make different characters. There's, go look at Wikipedia. There's, like, I can't even tell you. Nobody, everybody knows there's millions of, fi of these characters that nobody even, like, would think of creating. When I watch The Clone Wars, I'm like... Yep, there's a figure they should have made. There's one, there's one. There's so many. And they want to... They want to leave it and get rid of it. So I'm going to open this. This is the mint Ugnaught to add to my Ugnaught collection. I have about 20. Maybe either 15 or 20. I don't know how many, but... I got a decent amount, so. So I have another one of these Ugnaughts, which is dope. And he came with the box. His little lunch box carrying all sorts of stuff that we will never know. Yeah, I know, I do. Dude, I have like 20 Ugnaughts. I have like 30 Jawas now. I have four G IG-88s, and I got, like, ten Yodas. All different, like, just because, I don't know, they're cool. I just buy them. And there's the next figure. I lost him. So here is his staff. Ah! Almost went down. What's up, Romeo? Okay, there's his staff in there. Woo! I'm going to pop this puppy open. So since Romeo joined, I'll go back to to the Ugnaught from Vintage Toy Division. Shout out. And also, even though it's the Vintage Star Wars Club, old sticker. So yeah.
Now let's uh, pop this guy open. So I need like, the only figure I haven't had in my collection, aside from like really, really rare figures. Now there's still some weapons and accessories that I'm looking for, but I'm trying to get them all like complete and just like either sell mine or keep them, like run, do like a second run. But basically, the only, the only figure I'd never had was a pop-up Saber R2-D2, so I'm, I'm on the market, but I'm not gonna buy that figure yet until I find it at the right price, so. Or at a decent price, I, I'm not, I'll pay it. But this is, beep. dude, this guy's sick. So here we go, we got a Anana Man. His staff is right there. I'm gonna take that out next, but this is the second figure that I just opened. So shout out to Vintage Toy Division again for Anana Man. I think I've already bought one from him. So I, you know, like whatever. If you guys, like I've been buying from that, from uh, Vic for like three years, I feel like. Like half my collect, most of my collection came from him, but that's what I got. So, so I'm gonna add them. But first, since uh, since I got a mess going on, and I know, first I was doing this. I know you guys aren't that high demand on these guys, but Captain Rex. I opened Clone Wars figures first. I'm watching Clone Wars right now. Oh shoot! Hold on. Let me flip the camera. There we go. Jedi Toy Masters. I wanted to post a little thing, picture for him. So I just did that, basically. I can't reach, I got a lot. Since everybody's on, this is my mess that I got going on right now. I'm sweating because it's hot. So yeah. So what I'm doing is I'm going to take my Kenner, yep, and um, I'm gonna go through that container and that container. They're all like big Kenner ships, like the, like the, all that. Nice, yeah, the Met, it's really organized usually. Right now I'm just, yeah, I'm busting things open, showing some card backs, opening these figures and just kind of tearing stuff up until I have to deal with it later. But what I'm, let me go back. Can you open? Hold on. So yeah, this shelf, I'm gonna put all of my, well, as much as I can, my Kenner uh, vehicles, like I said before. And then I'm gonna put my Detoff here and I'm gonna put all the Kenner figures. I'm gonna get the risers from Gonk Toys soon and I'm gonna put those in there. And then I'm gonna get all my Kenner figures displayed again, so that'll be cool. But yeah, in there, it's all my, um, I still got some stuff to get rid of, but it's all my, sorry too. I still have some things to do before I do all that, but let me, let me go pull up my, yeah, I'm going to put another shell, I can't even reach, 6-1 and I can't even I get to the top of the shelf, yeah, that's scary. Yeah, let me uh, bear with me one second. Let me just go ahead and get all this down. Ugh. I can't reach. Oh, there's a staff. Let me make sure I put that to the side. Kenner messes are the best messes. Oh yeah, definitely. Ugh. Sorry, can't record it. There we go. Okay. Let me move this all around. But yeah, it's, it's a mess in here. And I'm going to be up doing it for a while. Just saw those card backs for HD. <laughs> so yeah, we're going to... We're going to start uh, putting these guys out. Because they've been uh, put away for quite some time. And they're sad because they've been sitting in containers for forever. And they don't know what to do with themselves. So I got to put those away. And now I got those, uh, that Anana man. 
And then if Moody Lose Lost Relics is on, he I'm getting some figures from him too. So I got two more vintage figures coming. I'll show those later. And then if there's more sales, then we'll we'll see what else we can get too, because I'm in the mood to try to get things a little bit more complete so I can do other stuff. But now I'm into Clone Wars, like I've said, so now it's like I wanna do I gotta do a bunch of other stuff. That's my unboxing though, so I'm not going to stay for too long. I just wanted to show the other last 17 figures I have right now. Before I leave, thanks everybody for watching though. Usually I have like one person on and nobody watches it on YouTube, so. But at least I get to talk to myself a while about Kenner. And talk to some, everybody's on today all. So that's cool. But yeah, so now I'm going to add him in there, so. But I have another thing to show you. Romeo, what's up, dude? You still on? Cool. Just setting stuff all over the place. Let me show you. Yeah, you gotta love tree rats. I'm gonna, like, install a, a air conditioning unit in this back closet. I just can fit everything here. Like, I'm, that's, why, that's why my girlfriend allowed me to put everything here. Because she's awesome. And it's the best place for it. I could show you guys everything, but you guys are probably busy at home, like me. What? Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Soon I won't. Soon I'm going to actually have everything out here and I'm gonna actually do them in front of what I have out so that that'll be better and I'll actually put my uh, put my camera on or my phone on something or something like that but yeah this is where my collections at put away it's all put away so I got like other ones that I can't even see the lighting so bad whoa so yeah, I'm gonna just lay in bed and watch the Clone Wars all night after I set this up. I'll take a picture though, and I'll show everybody what I what I will do if I do something. Like who had this? Yo, like this is the holiday special Chewbacca. Check that out. That's sick right there. Yeah. I gotta put some other things together. That's the belt for uh, the mail away set. That's the training ball for the Falcon that I gotta install. And then I got some uh, some IG-88s, because, like, why not? Mandalorian's sick, and they're freaking cool, so... I'll buy them all. But, yeah, so I did a bunch... I did get Clone Wars. I got a bunch of other stuff I could show. Can't do this all night, so... I'm gonna clean up, and I'm gonna get going. Stay tuned, because I'm gonna do other videos. Always, you know, go to my YouTube channel and look at anything random I post on there, and then I'll take pictures of the shelf after... I get um, it all finished. So as always, may the force be with you. Thanks you guys for watching.